by the year 1837. The warden's house, the east wing, and the perimeter wall enclosing these two structures are complete. Between 1870 and 1890, Newark's population grew significantly, forcing the construction of a new west wing, which almost doubles the jail's capacity. Over the next few years, a warden's office, warden's administration, and women's wing are added. This is shortly followed by the construction of new kitchens and the expansion of the entire complex northwards to include the north wing, followed by the hospital and a laundry by the year 1909. This completes the jail complex as we now see it, over 15 structures of various design, function, and historical significance.